Yeah, that's, that's that old joke. <laughs> uh, ABC Paramount, how long have you been with that label? Well, I've been with them now about two months now. And this is the first record for This them? is my first record out, yes. Good. Uh, how long has it been out? Just a couple of weeks? Well, it's been out about uh, almost two weeks, yeah. I see. Well, it's a very good, uh, very good record. We like it. Thank you very much. It swings. Oh. <laughs> that's why the kids like it. They like to put snaps into a record. Oh, thank you. Uh, I tell you what I've always wanted to do. Uh, I've always wanted to make a record and have a hit recording of my own. Yeah? That's sort of been my big dream. Now, tell me how you went about doing it, you know, coming to New York. Tell the whole story. Well, I came to New York about six months ago and uh, happened to be in the right place at the right time and with the right people. Mm -hmm. And uh, what other progress have you made on your career besides the uh, record? Well, I've uh, done a little bit uh, toward dramatics and... Uh, I have a uh, little thing working with Paramount Pictures. Well, you're doing all right with Paramount, aren't you? <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Very good. Uh, you, you eventually want to be, uh, go into movies or be an actor? Is that the idea? Well, that's eventually what I'd like to do, yeah, go into movies. Very good. I, I love the way you talk. Oh, thank Are, you. you. Have you met Carrie on our show? Yes, I she, met Carrie. She, come here, Carrie. Oh, my golly. Come here, Carrie. Step right yeah. in here. You've met Dallas, haven't you all? Oh, yes, I have. What's that? You have to speak yes, into I the have. TV. I have. You have a, <laughs> I should. They get along with They talk, and I don't know what they're talking about in rehearsal here. Uh, you look awfully spicy. Yeah, well, that must be what they meant. <laughs> We've got a letter that says our show is spicy. And I wondered what I see what they mean now. Do you have a guitar for him? Yes, I do. Fine. Go right ahead and give it to him. And I know you'll see him later. Thank you, Terry. Uh, you have one for me, Lynn? I tell you why I had them supply us with guitars, Dallas. Yeah. I told you my big dream was always to make a record. And I know that your big dream is to have a million seller, right? Right. That's it. I think we can solve both problems right here on the show. Uh, we're both going to do a song together that is sold a million and, uh, you know, that's doing quite well and give me a chance, too. <laughs> it's by the Everly Brothers, but uh, we're kind of sneaky. I have a new name for us if we record together. And here's the new name, the Effortless Brothers. You like that? I like that. Well, let's do it as effortlessly as we can. Here's all I have to do is a dream. Dream. We can do it. We're doing it, right? Someday we're going to sing for you. I just have that feeling tonight. We're going to sing. Tonight. Thank you, Dallas, so much for coming in and uh, playing Ephesus Brothers with me. Thank and you, uh, come back again with the new record. Thank you very Lots much. of luck on this one. Thank bye bye. You. Well, now, we're sweated up some little bit here. 
don't forget that label. It's ABC Paramount, Red Lips with Dallas Houston. I hope you like it. Now, let's see. Uh, we, have, uh, we have another uh, big number for you. The group has gotten together on the new ring jingle a ling a ring jingle ling Kirby Stone 4 record of Bobbles, Bangles, and Beads. They've done a good job of coming up with a big production for you. We're not already? I said, we're not already for Bobbles, Bangles, and Beads, so we'll sit and talk some more. Boy, if you knew what goes on here, it's really exciting. TV is really glamorous, isn't it, gang? Boy, I'm sure glad we got involved. 